and they remain one thing. So, our final answer is 7x squared plus 4x cubed plus 2x raised to power 4. Yes, please. I want to get your questions now. I should come again. Or how we're able to produce this answer. The question is minus 3x squared plus 5x squared plus 6x squared plus 4x cubed plus 2x raised to the power 4 minus x squared. I told you, the first thing is, remember, square is different from cube. Cube is different from power 4. So those one with x squared, bring them together. We are not crossing the quarter sign, so we are not changing the sign for those particular values. They are all together, right? Yeah. Then, we now move over to the other ones without square. So when we brought those ones with square together, when we collected them, we have minus 3x squared plus 5x squared plus 6x squared minus x squared. Then we are having the one without x squared, which is a plus 4x cubed. And another one, plus 2x raised to power 4. Those ones stand aloof on their own, right? So now the one with x squared, I'm holding 3 naira, I have 5 naira. You want to hold me on my neck? Yeah. Take me my money. Hold that I want to hold your money. Is that why you they hold me? You want to hold me? Not because of 3 naira. Call your money. When I give you your 3 naira, I might be having money. Yes. How much? 2 naira. 2 naira. So that's what this one is. This 2 means. Then another person gave me 6 naira. How much am I having? 8 naira. 7 naira. 8 naira. 8 naira. I'm going 3 naira. I have 5 naira. When I pay the 3 naira, how much am I having? 2 naira. Somebody now gave me 6 naira. How much am I having now? 8 naira. 8 naira. Only for me to go and buy suya of 1 naira. How much am I having? 7 naira. So do you see that when we have 7x squared plus 4x cubed plus 2x raised to the power 4. Oh, final answer. Who do not understand? Who do not understand? Cube and raised to the power 